Hi guys, starting today I will introduce to you the mainstream media effect series and I bet that you will get some value from that so I click the like button and subscribe to be well informed each time I will upload a new video from this series. Let's dive in. Validation is in essence the act of helping someone feel heard and understood. With that in mind, Instagram and TikTok is really a breeding ground for a lot of different things that can interfere with our mental health. You know, if a woman can get attention from positive actions, she will find a negative way to get it, like by throwing a tantrum or flirting with another man. Women don't want to follow a douchebag even on social media, but what happens is that she got a tons of orbiters who are kissing her ass, especially on Instagram or TikTok. There you'll see tons and tons of thirsty guys ready in any minute and each second to give her validations. You're so hot, oh, you're so gorgeous. Typically, the more messy their family environment was growing up, the more absent the father was, the weaker the father was, the less they got attention from daddy, the more they got more male orbiters around to fill that void. If you follow a woman on social media, be aware on what she's posting because she's telling the truth. But what happens when you go so thirsty and comment on each photo that she's uploading? Oh, you're so hot. Oh, you're so lovely. What's happening? I will tell you what. You give to her what she's looking for, aka your validation. She wants something from you? No, because she didn't reply to your comment. Then why do you stick around? Why, man? She didn't reply because she's not interested in you. That's not a lie. She has a, a lot of orbiters and now you're just another one. End of story. And Instagram has dramatically changed the way women socialize through photography. There is a spot that needs to be fulfilled, you know, the feminine energy craves to be filled up by love and attention. That's why women constantly feel empty and want to feel. The new norm is to get and gain attention and validation mostly from complete strangers. When women seek attention and validation on social media with flirty pictures, she is asking herself if you are the best she can do. Man, don't waste your time scrolling on Instagram to find the best booty. Don't be so thirsty to validate each pair of boobs that she's posting on. Invest in things that makes you feel good about yourself. Don't let Instagram rule your life and decide how happy you are. Stop scrolling and stop giving to women constant attention. From selfies to shout outs, short videos. Yeah, women are using TikTok both to build up and break down their self image. What happened to the days when women aspired to be more than just TikTok models? That time has long passed, man. The TikTok app, like many other social media apps, has reached the infamous stage of addiction. The most downloaded app on the App Store for the last year is barely understood by anyone over 35 and has already faced investigations, fines and bans on three continents. You know, from young girls under 18 doing my heart goes oops challenge to mature hot senoritas showing what their mama gave them. You know, I mean, 
Young girls and spicy senoritas up with the narcissistic influencer movement on other apps like Insta, for example, they've seen the perfect life, the perfect body, and that's why they've moved to TikTok. And where is a half-naked woman are also 50k chads to validate, give them constant attention. I mean, men. What you get as men from give them your time and energy, putting them on a pedestal, drawling on some 50 seconds video. You just feed her ego, man. You just feed her ego. Don't you have better things to do? I mean, yeah, a woman's body is something fascinating. But what you get from TikTok on a two-minute scroll will blow your mind. Just asses and half boobies all over. Women seeking validation, seeking free attention from thirsty men. As you see, there is a strong connection between these two apps and why women are so productive on Instagram and TikTok. And the prize is your validation, your constant attention. So, don't be a simple man and do not make her a star. Meanwhile, you're just another orbiter. See, it's not about Instagram versus TikTok. This is about you versus her constant attention that she needs. Because attention is like food and water for a woman. And they need a flow of emotions, both ups and downs. I'm Lucian and this was the episode for today. Remember, all starts with the right mindset.